you know, with the past couple of games being away, you know, can you, it doesn't feel good to be home. Yes, it's definitely good having our home crowd, even though we do have some boosters travel with us when we go to away games. It's definitely good being home and being home for the cause that we are here for, which is, you know, the breast cancer awareness. It's it's good to be here. Okay, and um, do you enjoy, you know, putting on that pink, going, you know, fall out for the breast cancer awareness? Yeah, I mean, it's something I think people don't really pay attention to enough. And not even just that, just cancer, period. People don't realize what impact it has, not just on the, vid the individual, but the people around them. So I think this is a time where Coach Nikki really wants us to realize the bigger picture and realize it's bigger than just a game of basketball. And, um, so you guys play in Florida tomorrow. Most of the teams that you've played, you've seen already. Is it somewhat refreshing to get a new team that you guys haven't seen today? Does it add a little bit more of a challenge or whatever? Um, I would say we res we respect every opponent the same, but we're gonna watch the film. We're gonna you know scout them the same way and you know just just see what they can do and see what they can't do and see what we can beat them with. And it's it's gonna be a challenge either way. Every team in the SEC is gonna be a challenge. So with, with them having a lot of shooters on their team, you know, a lot of the pressure is going to be on the guards for you guys mm -hmm. to limit that. So are you, you know, ready for the challenge to lock down some of the shooters? I would say I trust our defense. That's something we really um, hang our hat on, and that's something we really focus on in practice. And Coach Nikki, being a defensive coach, she's going to want us to be able to lock down and you know, run them off the three-point line, make them put the ball on the floor, make them feel uncomfortable and do things, you know, they're not used to doing or don't feel great at doing. Okay, and so moving forward to Kentucky in the last game you guys lost by four, so we remember what changes have been made to, to where you guys just feel confident that you guys can come out strong and not have to fire you back from down, what, 16? Um, we have been working on our offensive execution a lot more because at the end of the day we know – we are a defensive team, and when we really focus in, we can lock teams down. But being able to score is something huge for us that we need to be able to produce. Like, we can we can stop teams from getting their average, but if we're not scoring, it's, it's not going to be a good day for us. Yeah, when you guys played Kentucky, it seemed that they didn't have a lot of answers for you guys outside shooting, and Jim Richard Harris in particular. So do you guys plan on shooting more than you plan on shooting? <laughs> um, I think we we actually have been doing really well with getting the ball to a lot of different people to be able to score and sharing the ball. And playing together is something that we really we really do focus in on being able to get the ball inside and, you know, the post of being double or being able to kick, kick it back out and knock down those shots for them. So that is something we're going to be looking to a lot more these last few games. All right. And so Coach Nicky spoke about, like, how you guys are, you know, more involved in the, the scouting and how you guys are treating the home games and away games and stuff. And, you know, it's getting to the end of the season. You've been doing that for a couple of games. So, mm -hmm. are you feeling that you guys are getting the best product on the court now at a good time in the season to carry Oh, the um, definitely. Because every game matters, every result matters. And I think us being more in touch with the scout and in touch with the film, we're a lot more locked in when it comes into game time. Everyone knows their defensive assignments, everyone knows what they have to do. And knowing our role when we step on the court it makes everything a lot more easier. Like everything is smoother and just everyone being able to, you know, shut down their player, it comes together for us. Do you feel that the chemistry of the team is getting stronger as the season progresses? Um, definitely, definitely. I think especially with us having the SEC tournament and then, you know, wanting to be in for the NCAA tournament, we're a lot more focused on our goals and everyone is on one page. And I think that's really helping us come together when it comes to game time. Um, going through the season mentally, it's tough. It's tough on your body. And um, moving into postseason, it's just a lot. Uh, so what do y'all do to stay strong through that time? Um, Mickey, our athletic trainer, after every practice, cold tubs, cold tubs, cold tubs, recovery, off days. She's always telling us to come in for recovery. and. Um, you know, working out with Chris, he's always there to uh, stretch us and do any 
extra strengthening that we need to be able to keep going.